gateway drug to ale for <laughs> lager drinkers. I think it is, you know. I think it's because it's a little bit stronger. It's a bit cloudy. It's got a bit more taste to it. But it's mm. like, yeah, it's like it's like for young lads, basically, that don't like ale, isn't it? But, I've got yeah, a conspiracy. So. I've got a deep conspiracy. And it <laughs> oh, is this dead. is good. This is good. Let's hear it. <laughs> so I, I think it is uh, supermarkets. They've all got together and said, um, well, the beer section, it, it doesn't look pretty, does it? It's quite boring. <laughs> Now, it's all these pretty. fancy American beers, they've got nice, decor- dec- you know, they look nice, don't they? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So uh, that's the conspiracy. Yeah. So it catches people's eye. Exactly. Okay, I see. Because it all tastes the same. Yeah. So they're trying yeah. to outdo each other with how it looks. You're the so can. right. The moth to the flame. Yeah, it's a great idea. I, I agree. There's a, there's a supermarket cabal all above <laughs> us, sort of looking <laughs> down, pl- uh, <laughs> to- being the string master of their puppets yeah, telling yeah. us what drinks to buy I, I'm with you on that yeah <laughs> fantastic I mean I've done it several times I mean we've we've mentioned it that we're that we're not um, we're not opposed to that are we Greg that we, if we see something that just looks cool we'll buy it mm. like if yeah, something's got know. a goblin on it I know you've bought it <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, probably. Yeah. If it's something I care about, if I if it's something I'm interested in, any of drinks, food, whatever, got a goblin on it, yeah, I'll buy it. Fine. Yeah. <laughs> it's going to be good. Wizard or something, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, definitely. I think that's why, I mean, the German stuff, like, does that in a, to its own extent, doesn't it? Like, everything looks really mm. Bavarian on these German bottles. Like, yeah. Yeah, I, I mean, I'm not a graphic designer or anything, but I'm sure they'd be able to tell you like the fonts and stuff that these Germans use, and it looks like it just looks really Bavarian, and it makes yeah. you know, it makes my mouth water, and I want it. John Smith's hasn't quite got the same sort of uh, branding as it. It's just like really <laughs> plain. There's a gap green. in the market there. I mean, bodies as well. You know, just plain yeah. yellow with a black font. Sort there of bumblebee needs to be, thing. You know, like really popping out. Like I'm talking like Monster Energy Drink kind of font. Yeah. But it's just, you know, widget esque. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <I think. laughs> Something there, that yeah. catches the eye of the young uns. Right? Yeah. Good shout on the vice beer, though. Me and uh, me and my missus, this is back in the drinking days, so uh, about three weeks ago. <laughs> we, uh, <laughs> we, again, don't roll your eyes, but we bought a couple of those big hoe gardens. Oh, yeah. No, that's great. I love a hoe oh, garden. Okay. I, I yeah. thought hoe garden was, uh, you know, looked down upon because oh, it's no. the obvious choice. It's. it's Mate, I, I, yeah, no, not at all, not at all. It's uh, it's a winner. It's an absolute winner. And like you say, mm. you got to pour it on the side. I don't want, I don't want a flake. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> well, this this was a very, uh, very varied alcohol round. Um, considering, you know, from water, <laughs> <laughs> we're starting at the source, the, the, mate. <laughs> Start at the source. Exactly. You don't get booze uh, without water, lads. That's yeah, all I'm saying. True. <laughs> that's true that's very true it's important uh, it's important it's a key uh, ingredient <laughs> yeah done so right I'm going to ask this because I'm sure a lot of blokes are going through the same thing how are you managing to not kill yourself at the moment <laughs> <laughs> in all seriousness oh, I mean I'm the, I'm the cheeriest bloke in the world uh, but I'm, I'm thinking about it lads I'll be honest <laughs> <laughs> I don't believe it. I don't believe it. it I was no. I was chatting to a few mutual friends, and um, can oh can I just say, Greg, like yes, obviously, me and Adam have known each other a long time. Um, yeah, this is probably about the third time I've ever called him Adam. <laughs> um, yeah. It's very very strange. So every time I refer to Adam as Adam. Yeah. There's yeah. a p- little part of me that goes, this ain't right. Nah. <laughs> this is not right. <laughs> anyway. anyway. <laughs> I completely forgot what I was going to say. We've, we've got, got yeah, to the To the listeners, Spoke yeah. We've, to we've mutual all, friends. We've all got a few different nicknames. So it's, yeah, it's, it's funny having to consolidate mm. it. Because if we came out with all the nicknames, any listeners who stumbled upon us for one episode and promptly gave us up, would, uh, they, wouldn't, they wouldn't make it to the end of the episode without sort of forgetting who we were if all the nicknames came out. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, <exactly. laughs> Very true. But anyway, I was chatting to mutual friends about Adam. <laughs> and, and I was just saying, you know, he, he's, he's, he's amazing because he's so positive. Like, he's always up. And, uh, you know, when I'm having a down day, I'll, I'll send him a ludicrous story and I can't wait for his reply. <laughs> like, about which know. word's been cancelled 
Or, yeah, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> or, or how we've changed the Eng- English language or something. Or yeah. what hairstyle yeah. you can't have anymore, or, you know. <laughs> yeah. And uh, I, I can't wait for his reply. Nice. Yeah, um, the more so, uh, the more ludicrous, the better, please, on those yeah. those stories that you send me. They're absolutely so fantastic. So I'm not yeah. having it, mate, that you're close to the edge. I mean, uh, I'm on I'm on the edge, but mind you, I I was on the edge before COVID. I mean, so yeah. let's not muck about. <laughs> you always skirt that fine line, don't you? That's where you're exactly. actually between genius and madness. Yeah, yeah. I, I'm, yeah. I'm there. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I don't know. Uh, it's just get, it's getting to me. This not you know not being able to see people. I mean, these you know recording the podcast is a highlight of the week for sure. You know, mm. and I I have some big laughs and stuff. But it, yeah, I mean. No offense to anyone, it's just not the same. Like as being mm. real life, being in the pub, having a few beers, like you know, being able to slap each other on the back and b- big <laughs> belly laughs and who's getting the next round in that sort of thing. Like it's yeah. you can't put a price on that. Like no. it's it's absolutely <laughs> insane. I know it sounds silly, like saying no, that you're loud. right, mate. No, I'm with you. You know what I mean? Just that physical mm. physical thing. Yeah, it's it's crazy. But uh, yeah, we'll get there. I mean, this we've we're. Um, I don't want to date the podcast in case people <laughs> cotton on in a few years' time, but you know we're sort of <laughs> mid lockdown three three point oh now, uh, yeah. lockdown with a vengeance. <laughs> I think this one's mm. called into <laughs> yeah, Sam, 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 Sam Jackson. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, it's the best lockdown. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh god, uh, uh, it's the only one that yeah. I'll watch during the year. You know, I won't watch. I'll only during watch summer. Uh, yeah. Die Hard with a Vengeance or Lockdown with a Vengeance during the year. The the first two mm-hmm. I, I restrict specifically for Christmas time. That's ludicrous. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what you'll watch Die Hard one during the year? Yeah, yeah. Cause it's a, oh yeah, it's yeah, a great yeah. I will film. do that too. Really? I, I mean, oh, of course. I mean, it's of course it's a great film, but I, I just like that feeling when I get to Christmas, and I'll save it for Christmas Eve as well. I've told you this before. Like I, I will I, watch. Yeah, you mean Christmas Eve, so that when John McClane turns up at Nakatomi Plaza. It, it's mm. the same time as I'm watching it, Christmas Eve, and I feel like I'm there with him, uh, saving you, the world. You time from it perfectly so that it's like the that certain point in the film starts at twelve o'clock on Christmas Eve or something. Is yeah, that, yeah, exactly. Yeah, <laughs> uh, I'm gonna do that have next you year. Seen, have you two seen that meme of uh, Forrest Gump? If if you start Forrest Gump at ten thirty eight, by the time it gets to the New Year's Eve, you know where uh, Lieutenant Dan is just sat there and all the confetti is on his face, like yeah. yeah. <laughs> And you just look so miserable. Like you, you will be at midnight watching it with Lieutenant Dan. That's Amazing, you, with Christmas yeah. Eve and Die Hard, is it? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. Oh, we've got nice. to do that. Add that to the list of things we're never going to do. Pop it yeah, <laughs> it's on. It's on. <laughs> so I, mean, uh, I, I watch uh, Jingle All the Way any time of year. Really? Oh yeah. God! Wow. I was going to say that I wish I could because it's the best film. Ever made, oh, but um, Greg, the man of my heart. <laughs> no, 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 dude, put the cookie down. A <laughs> line that lives throughout. <laughs> Whenever I get a chance, I'm screaming that. Anyone, anytime someone even thinks about picking a cookie up, I'm screaming it at them. I think, I think that is uh, Schwarzenegger at his finest. Oh God, no! Uh, that's, yeah, that's 100%. his finest work, mate. No, that and yeah. uh, Kindergarten Cop. Oh, yeah, he really gets to the gets to the bottom of the character, you know. Really fleshes him out, and uh... he's a method actor, really, isn't he? Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh god, damn! No, 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 no. Listen, I'm I'm Arnold Schwarzenegger's biggest fan. I love him to pieces. I've seen almost everything he's done. I've read his books, all etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera. However, those they are great films, but they're not the best. No what about way. Twins? What about twins? No, no! Oh, Jesus! <laughs> <laughs> no way is Kindergarten Cop, Twins, and Jingle All the Way better than Predator and Commando. No, no, no way! No. I will uh, not have it. <laughs> I, um, I I'm with you on. Pre- Sorry to interrupt. I, no, I'm, 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 I'm with you. I, I unironically do love. I'm, I'm, I'm uh, in shock. <laughs> Sorry, I'm, I, I'm speechless. I'm literally speechless. <laughs> Actually. You and I both uh, know that dead air is a crime. Okay, <laughs> sorry, we won't get bogged down in in that again. <laughs> oh Jesus, I'm not northern enough for this. Um, all right, so uh, unironically though, Jingle All the Way, Christ, I can't even get my thoughts straight. Jingle All the Way is a fantastic film, Adam. Yeah, ag- agreed for a agreed. Christmas film, i.e., possibly one of the best Christmas films out there. Yeah, um, yeah top ten. So within a genre. I think it's not. It's okay to say it's one of the best films ever made. 
In terms of best Arnie film, I will say Terminator 2. Yes, 100%. No question. Yeah. No question. Uh, I think... Predator, man. Oh. Come on. I love Predator. I do love Predator, but I think Pre- Terminator 2 takes the... Man, yeah, I mean, you don't cry at the end of Predator. I cry at the end of Terminator 2. Yeah, true. It's it, Yeah, it's very close. It is very close. I'll give you that. Yeah, I might... Listen, I'm going to back down on this one. I'll give you Terminator 2. <laughs> yeah, the but, only thing lacking in Terminator 2 is... Uh, Nudity. Nudity? Yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> like in the first one. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, exactly. Hence, yeah. hence only the 15 rating as opposed to 18 on the first one. Yeah, mm. they were going for a mass market, weren't they? And, and yeah. then they just got <laughs> 15, 12, PG. Now that I've been the latest ones are you. Yeah. Pathetic. You. Pathetic. Oh, I love, love it how. Me, love me. <laughs> Everybody watch me. We don't want to exclude people under 12. <laughs> Oh, man. You know, uh, I love the fact that when you, um, if you watch something that's a you on Netflix, usually like a Pixar thing or something, and it's a you, and it comes up and it's still got a little parental warning in the top yeah. top mm. corner that says, uh, mild peril. <laughs> I just yeah. love that about you films. It's like, you can't, you can't really have a story without something going wrong, surely. So, yeah. to, you know, to have a little parental advisory, mild peril. What the the mean? the car from Cars runs out of petrol or something like what, <laughs> what? What on earth do you mean by mild peril? Jesus, that's a bit deep, mate. That's like but, running out of blood for them. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> true. Yeah, <laughs> that's fair. That's Christ. fair. I'll give you that. <laughs> it's disgusting. Uh, yeah. <laughs> what should we get an oil change like open heart surgery? Oh, yeah. God. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Humanity. <laughs> disgusting. <laughs> Oh, oh God! Dear. I can't even remember where, where we got how we got here. Well, we were not, talking about Arnie. Is, yeah, talking uh, about Arnie. Well, so but, uh, but Jingle, hey. Jingle All the Way. Yeah, I was saying I, uh, yeah. I couldn't watch Jingle All the Way during during the year. It's got to be a Christmas thing. I, I agree with that. Even as much as I love it, I can't watch it. I wish I could, but it just wouldn't feel right. I think it's because of the ac- the lack of action in Jingle All the Way. If it was Die Hard, for example, like you're saying, you can watch it as an action film and just try and forget about the Christmas thing, and it's mm. you can watch it in August. But because Jingle All the Way has little proper action, it's like it's just a Christmas <laughs> film. I mean, can, this I, jump- ju- can I just what? straight away say? It's turbo time! <laughs> if that's not action, my friend, yeah. I don't know what is. Uh, I mean, it's not yeah. action. It's mild peril at best. Really. <laughs> Very yeah. good. Tell that to the cop who uh, <laughs> opens the bomb and it blows up on his face. Yeah. But still manages yeah. to walk away with just bandaged yeah. hands. Yeah. Exactly. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. He's just got... <laughs> Phenomenal. Uh, oh damn I mean that poor uh, bomb making skills there like, yeah, yeah exactly oh yeah should have shoddy sh- should have taken a few tips from Hurt Locker shouldn't it so. <laughs> well, yeah. although I love the fact that it shook the building yeah, <laughs> but yeah. yeah it still only managed to scorch his hands <laughs> yeah <laughs> the foot between his hands and his face probably wasn't enough yeah. for the bomb to to, to get through oh dear <laughs> So, um, listen, I was very excited when, when uh, I knew we were getting you on the, on the podcast, Pete, because I knew that uh, the northern ometer would be tipped slightly in my favour. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> However, the, the, uh, the enjoyment that I felt in that moment was, was swiftly quashed with the realisation that a man, another Manchester United fan was, was going to be on the podcast. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so I'm well, how are you feeling, number. mate? How are you feeling? What, what, what do you want to talk about, mate? Uh, you know... <laughs> How about this? How about this new lad that you've paid God knows how much money for, and that can't even get into the first team at Alitalia or whatever it is Atalanta. Atlanta. Atalanta, yeah. Not even what Atlanta. Other... Not not <laughs> even Atlanta. Atalanta. <laughs> well, I think they're in Champions League, aren't they? So don't Are write they? him off. Is he going to be the? Is he going to be the best thing since sliced bread? Then this lad. No, because we already have the best thing since sliced bread. Pogba. No. Fernandez. <laughs> no. Who? Who? Mate, Ronaldo Just hasn't played Ar- for United Aaron in Aaron years. Je- Jesse Lingard. Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> <laughs> that, is, that is clearly a joke. Walcott. <laughs> <laughs> Lingardino. Uh, no, Bruno. Bruno, come on. Yeah. Taglioni. Yeah, <laughs> Bruno Taglioni. <Tanioni. laughs> <laughs> yeah. i tell you what. He'd be... He would be a good... Uh, companion on a night out. Tanyoni. Oh yeah. Say what you want about him. 
Yeah, he would be. Yeah, he would. The, the, he'd bring a lot of uh, frivolity, that's for sure. <laughs> There'd be a lot of prancing about. I don't know about that. Yeah, but we. Nick- 